Welcome at Rolight and Sound. We are here at the Madrix booth in Hall 5.0, the booth number C48. And I want to show you today three new exciting products. Uh, the first one is a Madrix software update for Madrix 3.6. And we have two new exciting hardware products, which is Madrix Stella and Madrix Nebula. This is a Madrix software release candidate 3.6 we are showing here at ProLight and Sound 2016 and we are introducing with uh, Madrix 3.6 first fe new feature is we are now introducing the German language so you can use the software the German user interface I switch back to English right now one new feature we have very professional users from the United States for big stages they are doing big productions and they want to work with more than one guy at the patch. And we are introducing with Madrix 3.6 a, a feature called merging the patch. So more than one people can work on one patch at the same time. This is my patch and I can go now to file, merge patches and I can load another patch which may be programmed from another guy. I open this and if I open it takes a few seconds and after that we will see a new window. In this window we see the information about the current existing patch and the new patch. And I can place the new features, fixtures over here in this direction. I can type in the number here, the number 50, press OK. And now I add the new features here. So in this way I am able to create a big huge patch within a few seconds if a lot of people are working on the patch. So I go back to the software. I want to show you we are improving all the effects. Here on the left side you see the color scroll effect and a new feature is called displacement. If you see this one it manipulates the color scroll and get beautiful effects. And also new is this new feature and we call this storage place parameter chaser. With a storage place parameter chaser you can do the following if you watch here. I created three layers and I click now here plus. I move this layer down. I click plus. Move this layer down and click plus. And I change the timings for the fade time to for example five seconds. And I press play. We have now an effect parameter chaser we are introducing with Matrix 3.6. One more feature I want to show is the color filter for the left side and the color filter for the right side. Let's imagine you, you are programming the effects in a white color. For example here a radial effect and on the right side Another radial effect, maybe with a different mode, like this. We are now introducing with Madrix 3.6 the color filter for the left side and the color filter for the right side. These are the hardware products uh, which we are producing in Germany. So all these products here are proudly made in Germany. The NEO is um, very easy to use, USB to the mix interface. It includes already the Matrix software license. Plexus is similar to NEO with two universes output, two times 512 channels. It includes an SD card so you can create your show on the Matrix software and export to the SD card and this device runs standalone without a computer. Great for architectural environments. The Luna 4, 8 and 16 are all 19 inch devices with 4, 8 and 16 ports times 512 channels output. You can connect to these devices via USB or Ethernet to your Matrix computer. Because it's ArtNet devices, you can use these devices also with your big console. We are now introducing at this year's ProLight and Sound the new Matrix Stella and Nebula. These devices are made for solid state applications. So you can use these devices for permanent installs. You can mount these devices on DIN rail. So this is DIN rail mount. Plus 
You can use screws to mount it on the wall or on the ceiling. Madrix Stella is connectable using USB, Artnet and the power and it outputs two universes DMX. So it's similar to a Luna 4 but it has no um, Neutrik plugs. It's a screw terminal so you can connect directly with wires to a Stella. Nebula it's brand new for controlling SPI related LEDs. You find a lot of LED products on the market already with the protocols like WS2801. And you can connect this device via USB, Ethernet and 5 to 24 voltage. You can connect the pixel tape for example with WS2801. Each port provides an output of up to four universes. So this device is eight universes of data for a very affordable price. This was a quick overview about our new products. If you are interested in our products, please contact your local dealer or distribution. Contact or contact us at www.medrix.com. Thank you. Bye bye.